And now to the countdown to Michael's liftoff to space. And space exploration has not only helped us learn all about our solar system, it has led to some extraordinary inventions here on Earth. Gio Benitez is back with more on that. Hey, Gio. Hey, Amy. There is groundbreaking research happening right now in space. From finding ways to adapt to climate change, to vertical farming, to the 3D printing of human organs. But you may be surprised about things we use in everyday life that started in space. Ignition, lift off. Scientific discovery has fueled our fascination with outer space, from the beginnings of the space race, as seen in Hollywood films like Hidden Figures. The goal point for re-entry is 2,990 miles from where we want Colonel Glenn to land. To finding new methods to sustain life on Mars, so, like in The Martian. I gotta figure out a way to grow three years worth of food here on a planet where nothing grows. Luckily, I'm a botanist. And while it may seem like science fiction, the innovations developed in the pursuit of space exploration are very real, from the cameras in our phones to the memory foam in our mattresses. We invent a lot of really, really interesting things as a res result of exploration. And those inventions and those technologies actually are so useful right back down here on Earth. Former NASA astronaut Dr. Katie Coleman has been on three missions to space, spending almost six months on the International Dubai, Space the Station, participating in research studying the effects of weightlessness on plant growth, water behavior, and her own body's response to the lack of gravity. We actually lose bone and muscle 10 times faster than a woman who is 70 years old who has osteoporosis. And because it happens to us so quickly up there, that knowledge comes right back down here to Earth when we also understand how can we prevent and help people with osteoporosis right here. Space tech has made a huge impact on medical advancements around the world, from implantable heart monitors to water purification systems. Laser eye surgery was made possible because of NASA hardware that tracks involuntary eye movements. Even robotics created to make repairs to the space station are now used to help surgeons perform less invasive procedures. It's amazing, isn't it? And here we have some of these items, these everyday items that have history in space. You see that dust buster right there? NASA worked with Black & Decker for tools to collect rock samples during the Apollo moon landings. That led to this. Freeze-dried foods, they were created for long space missions where you need to keep things light. The coating for those scratch-resistant glasses, that was created for astronaut visors. And Michael Strahan's courage, that's also gonna be created in space. <laughs> we gotta get you up there after Michael. Listen, I'm ready. I'm ready. I, I partially blame Gio for this because <laughs> I went there with you, and ever since you, you changed my life. Oh well, wow! wow. He really did. That. that is the headline, folks. Gio, <laughs> <laughs> Michael, <laughs> we are so excited. One week from today. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.